Good morning, you guys. Today, we are gonna go venture to the museum, Malva, and then just basically we're gonna walk around. Sam and I are kind of just wanting to enjoy the Saturday. But I just wanted to show you guys really quick before we go that I've officially turned into a European mom because look at what I'm wearing. I'm wearing this, what is it called? Button down, and I'm also putting this, the sweater on top. And you know what? It just came so natural to me this morning to do this little move here. And it just, it just turns out that I've turned into a European mother. This is what happens when you spend at least three weeks in Argentina. You'll start doing some moves like this. All right, let's go. shown us that it has beautiful trees beautiful gardens everywhere it's so big you guys too that like I think it's impossible to see all of Buenos Aires fully fully because it's just so massive but what we've seen so far is just a really metropolitan city that really feels very European there are beautiful parks everywhere there are beautiful trees right now it's like turning into fall time here, which is interesting because where we're from, California, it's like turning into summer right now. I'm really enjoying it. We gotta go. <laughs> There's also a lot of museums, a lot of really pretty cafes and restaurants all over the city. The area that we're walking through right now is called La Recoleta and it's one of the most exclusive neighborhoods in Buenos Aires. I've heard that it's expensive and I guess the very elites live here or work here or hang out here and I mean it is very pretty so a lot of museums here and parks and a lot of important things I guess are around here too. You ready? Let's go. Hola. Ah, uh, dos general, por favor. A thousand five, four hundred. All right, we're in. Tickets in hand. Sam purchased the tickets in Spanish because he's now fluent.
to think. It was beautiful. It was not the biggest museum. It was kind of small, three floors, but it was pretty cool. So yeah, highly recommend if you guys are in Argentina to come visit this museum. Um, it's like a short and sweet one, but there's a lot of cool things in there to check out, so recommend. Now I think we're gonna go try to find somewhere to eat and maybe find an Aperol and then, and then, I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna go somewhere. We might hang out with our friends Sabrina and Kyle. They invited us over to their house to play a board game. I don't know why though, because I feel like if I play with Sam or anybody else, I'll win and then everybody gets so sad. I don't know. But we need to go find some Wi-Fi because without it, we cannot communicate with them. shops here in Argentina apparently it's been here for a very long time since 1963 I want to say or 64 Sam got a coffee with a little alfajor which is really oh, typical of uh, Argentina and I got an Aperol spritz cheers me mm. so good Tiramisu, shout out to my bro <laughs> and pistachio. Oh yeah, and then I got almonds and cream and coconut dulce de leche. We're entering this little park area, which is really nice. We're gonna enjoy this park, enjoy our ice cream. Shout out to Daniel, we know you like tiramisu. I like parks. <laughs> parks are nice, huh? How would you describe this temperature? Just for the viewers. Korean is called salsa hai. Salsa hai? Salsa. Salsa. It's like a bit chilly. Okay. But not too cold. Uh huh. Light sweater. Do you think he speaks Spanish? So cute. We're stopping at a place called Mandini, and we're gonna get some sweets for our Sabrina and Kaile to take to their house. We really want to find a brownie, but if not, I think we're just gonna like pick out a few things for them. Hopefully, they're delicious. There is a very big line out the door, so it seems like this place is gonna be good. One of that, one of that, one of that. One of those like chocolate spreads. Whatever it's gonna say. Uh huh. What's in there? Brownie. What <laughs> nuts. Sabrina really likes uh, brownies, so. We're gonna bring that to her. Will we play tag? No way. Or will we play the other game? <laughs> Century? I'm trying to find the explanation of how long it takes and the four words saying that 
all friendships must end after the event. No! How was it? Dude, how am I supposed to know? Exactly. Uh, I have to get Google Translate. <laughs> South America? No! Yeah. You can't play. So you you will win if no. you have the whole country of Europe and South America. It's really hard. <laughs> it's not worth it, you guys. We have one more week. Exactly. <laughs> can't wait till we buy a good boat. <laughs> Hi guys, I just wanted to come on to probably end the video here. We had a really good time. We played a board game and we ate and we laughed and it was so fun. Now I am exhausted. So I think Sam and I are probably gonna watch Peaky Blinders and then we're gonna sleep. Good night guys. Save the planet. Save the whales. They suffocate on balloons. <laughs>